Everyone loves a good mystery. A military trunk that was discovered in a St. Paul building contains a treasure trove of family keepsakes. As Maury Glover shows us, the woman who found it is trying to get it now to its rightful heirs. And I found this steamer trunk. Uh, from the military, and it belongs to a gentleman named Edward Welke. This old steamer trunk is full of pieces of the past from foreign currency. We have some old Deutschmarks, it looks like. To dice, but it also holds a mystery. So I really wanted to find a home for this. I really wanted to go to the family. So I think it's very important, and it's historical. Lauren Hunshammer found the trunk in a building in St. Paul her grandfather used to own that was recently sold and cleaned out. She believes it belonged to a man named Edward Welke, who worked for her grandfather in the 70s and contains personal possessions from his life, like letters, dog tags, and discharge papers from the Army, which Hans Hammer would like to get to Welke's family, but she doesn't know where they are. We know that he died in 1982, and we know that Lily and his wife died in 1976, and they were both very young when they passed away. Um, and we know that he worked for my grandfather in the 1970s, in the late 70s. And that's where the story ends. Hans Hammer has learned Welke and his wife were stationed in Japan after World War II. And they wanted to bring a Japanese child named Susie Ballard to the United States to be adopted, which required congressional approval. But she doesn't know where Susie is, if she's still alive, or if she had any children who would want to know about their family's history. As a family member, I would want to see those things. I would want to be able to touch them and, and learn a little bit more about my heritage and what my grandfather did. Hans Hammer says she's lucky she found the trunk because she's emotionally attached to her own family. And she hopes this is one mystery that will soon be solved. I lost my father, and my grandfather obviously is no longer with us. So to me, just having these artifacts to hold on to is very, very important. Maury Glover, Fox 9.